Hey guys, this is Tony. Um, I'm just showing you a completed um, belt that I just recently did. This is very uh, similar to my LED system. Um, pretty much um, uh, the heat sink is from a Solaris um, LED company which is a, I believe my friend told me it was a $2,500 system and um, the optics are from them also so I used the optics and I used the heat sink but I used my own LED and driver um, this is a pretty simple build you just serial all of them all around and connect them at the end I mean I could have ran it um, a different way but this is the simplest I can do it um, these are waterproof and they're um, double sided uh, mounting tape mounting tape to mount them together so to give them um, st stability Just, and <clears throat> I'm losing my voice and uh, the uh, power goes in here I was gonna do independent plugs for each one but um, I think it looks more neater with just one plug so I just chopped off an extension cord and hooked it up to it um, show you guys how this thing oh, how this thing lights up so one second guys let me get this it's pretty it's pretty bright I mean, here we go Whoa, yeah. See how the camera, um, I try to adjust to that. Now I'm seeing spots in my eye, but yeah, this is pretty much a, um, the newest recent build I just did. Um, I just added some conduit to make the wires pretty, and that's about it, guys. I mean, it's pretty simple. Um, these drivers are fairly uh, easy to connect. I mean, they're not dimmable or anything, so there's only two wires on each end. And um, each driver drives 12 LED. So there's two of them, there's 24 LED total. And this should be enough for a uh, frag tank or a nano tank or something. Or you want to go, I don't know how much power. We're going to get a power measurement of these and see how much power it produces. But despite that, um, you guys know, um, my old subscribers, you guys know that I have a big fish tank coming in. Um, I will show you guys a preview picture of it, but I forgot to take a picture of it. But it's not a 300 gallon tank. It's a little bit smaller. Um, it's only 6 foot. It's not an 8 foot like I expected, but the 8 foot is still coming in, okay guys. This is a... Um, I guess a project after a project and the um, six foot tank is gonna be the next up in line is already um, is at my friend's place right now and uh, I think I'm gonna start to we're gonna make the stand for it first but maybe I'm gonna do this tank an aggressive tank like with um, uh, I'm just gonna throw a couple animals out there. Have you guys never heard of it? Of course, you yeah, heard of a stingray, but a blue spotted stingray is gonna be one of the animal uh, in there, and a uh, a shark, a small shark. I think a bamboo shark, I believe. And um, it's gonna be an aggressive tank, but I think it's gonna be fun because I get to play. I get to get fish. Of course, it's gonna be a big line fish. Um, so, stay tuned for this build, and uh, welcome new subscribers. <clears throat> I'm losing my voice, sorry guys. <clears throat> and uh, if uh, you guys have any questions, feel free to ask. And um, I'll try to reply it as soon as I can. Alright guys, have a good holiday. I'm out. <laughs>